Hello, everyone. So, a lot of my students really struggle to wrap their heads around market failure. So, the first video of this series, I'm going to talk about the situation where there is no market failure, where the market actually achieves allocative efficiency. Okay, so I want you to remember that allocative efficiency happens when there is no market failure. It happens when the quantity that is produced by the market, QM, is equal to the socially optimum quantity, Q opt. When QM is equal to Q opt, the market has not failed. The market has achieved allocative efficiency. So there are four curves you need to think about, okay? First of all, we know from demand and supply that the intersection of the demand curve, which is the MPB, the marginal private benefit, that's the extra benefit the consumer derives from consuming one additional unit, and the supply curve, which is the MPC, the extra cost of producing one additional unit. This is the market equilibrium. This gives us QM. Now, in the case of no market failure, there are no externalities. So the MPC just happens to also align with the MSC because there are no external costs on the supply side, on the production side. Okay, so the MPC and the MSC align and the MSB and the MPB align. The MSB is the extra benefit society gains from consuming one additional unit. The MSC is the extra cost of producing one additional unit. All right. Now, two conditions I want you to remember. Market equilibrium happens at QM. This happens when MPB is equal to MPC. Allocative efficiency happens, which it gives us QOPT, where MSB is equal to MSC. If there are no externalities, they will all align. So the MSC will align with the MPC. MSC will align with the MPC. The MPB will align with the MSB. And QM will also equal QOPT. The market equilibrium is also the socially efficient equilibrium. This is the case where the market achieves allocative efficiency. Consumer surplus and producer surplus are maximized and thus community surplus or social surplus is maximized. So before I actually begin the videos about market failure, I want you to wrap your head around this concept of allocative efficiency and the basically absence of market failure. Um, we don't have a word called market success, but this is essentially what market success looks like. OK, the supply curve, which is the MPC, happens to align with the MSC because there are no external costs of production. The demand curve, which is the MPB, happens to align with the MSB because there are no external um, costs or benefits on the consumption side. Let me know what you think. See if you can wrap your head around this concept and please leave any questions in the comments. Have a good one and I look forward to the next video in the series. Bye.